if you look at like early American history, there were duels and, mm -hmm. <laughs> and things like that, which we don't have anymore. So in some senses, we're, we're more civil. Um, we also have more rules um, that restrict what members can do. Um, there's ethics rules, which indicate what, what members of, of Congress can say on the floor and, and things like that. Um, so in some ways, it it's, might even be more civil, but I think you're right about the new forums that make it all just so prevalent in, in everyday life. There's more people doing it, and we see it more, more visibly. You know, in the old days, newspapers were um, party papers, and we'd have all kinds of incriminating statements and things in them, but they were just read by partisans, and it wasn't, mm -hmm. it wasn't something you saw in, the, in your living rooms as you were, mm -hmm. you know, watching TV and, and that kind of thing. So I think the, the forums, uh, the computer obviously makes a big difference in terms of the freedom that, that people have to make um, visceral kinds of kind of statements. So I think the computer, um, because it's so distant, you know, you're just sitting there at the computer, it's real easy for people to say even more inflammatory things than they would say to somebody uh, in person. So I think the, the medium uh, make, makes a big difference. So. I think it goes too far once it starts interfering in the, in the normal political process. So if you start seeing people not showing up and voting, um, the last couple election years we've actually had increases compared to um, 10 years or so ago. Um, if we start to see voter turn off, turnout start falling again, I think that would be a sign that you know, democracy is not healthy because of it and people are, are not participating. Um, if it becomes more difficult to get people to run for office for fear that they're going to be you know, so personally attacked, uh, either verbally or physically, that um, nobody wants to serve, then I think then it becomes problematic. Um, if the rhetoric becomes so um, hateful that nobody will be willing to compromise with each other, uh, then again, I think it becomes, becomes too severe. In the long term, I don't think it's going to have any effect because I think it's politically expedient and I think it's also uh, become such the, the norm of politics that it's going to be really hard for people to uh, really step back.